Hey guys, this is Wacka Lab, and this week I'm going to show you how to build a Lego beach scene. Um, uh, the features in it are some waves right here, crashing in on the shore. Well, I won't say crashing, just rolling in on the shore. It has a really cool jagged rock, like it would in the ocean, that my minifigure right here seems to be taking a very relaxing nap on. Maybe he's dead. I don't know. I blame the crab. But anyway... Um, it has a cool palm tree right here, resting behind these rocks. And let me turn it around for you, so you can see it a little better. And there you go. And here's the overview of it. But um, anyway, let me show you the pieces you're going to need. But before we get there, I have a shout out for this week. And this week's shout out goes to none other than Lego Paradise. I thought this would be a pretty cool tutorial to give him a shout out to because this is kind of like a Lego Paradise right here. But anyway, he has some pretty amazing Lego tutorials. He does awesome mocks and he's just packed full of Lego. So you should really check him out. So anyway, let's move on to the pieces now, shall we? Okay, so here's the pieces you're gonna need. Uh, you're gonna need um, this 8 by 16 base plate, 6 of these 1 by 8 flat smooths, you're going to need 2 of these 1 by 6 flat smooths, 2 1 by 4 flat, uh, yeah, 2 by 1 by 4 flat smooths, and 2 1 by 4 flats. Okay, so you're going to start off by getting your base plate. And then you're going to get two, actually three, 1 by 8 flat smooths. And put it right here. Put one right here. Another one right here. Now you're going to get a 1 by 4 flat smooth. Put it right here. And then you get a 1 by 4 flat, put it right here. Then you're going to get a um, 1 by 6 flat smooth, put it right here. Another 1 by 6 flat smooth, put it right on the other side. Then you're going to get your 1 by 4 flat, put that in the middle. And I'll let you see the pattern. And then. You're going to get a 1 by 8 flat smooth and put it right like that. And then you're going to basically kind of try putting it in the middle of that 1 by 8 flat smooth. Straight in the middle. And it should look like that. Okay? And now you're going to get your 1 by 8 flat smooth. And then you're going to put it right there on the edge and make sure there's a little um, a slot here left open. The same with a 1x4, almost to the end. And then the rock is going to be like fitting in right there. And you're just going to leave those like that so it kind of looks like a wave washing up there. So the rock's going to go there. So let me show you the pieces you're going to need for the rock. Alright, so here's the pieces you're going to need for the rock. You're going to need four detailed slant pieces. You're going to need a 2x2 two two flat, a 1x2 uh, slant piece, a 1x2 flat smooth, four, four gray 1x1 one one flat smooths that are gray. Uh, and then you're going to need um, one one by one flat smooth brown okay and then you're gonna need two of these two by two weirdly slant pieces and as you can see it's not even a total height of a brick it's only two flats high when a normal brick is three flats high so you need two of those and of course you're gonna need this two by two brick and then you're gonna need this slant piece or arched piece or whatever you want to call it. To start off you're going to need your beach uh, 
is it from the previous section and what you're gonna do is get your detailed slant piece and put it right here on the right then you're gonna get this one by one flat smooth put it right next to it like that and then you're gonna get your two by two brick and you're gonna put it right there and then you're gonna get this weirdly slanted piece here put it on top of it then you're gonna get your one by two flat smooth put it on top of that then you're gonna get your two by two flat put it right next to it get your one by two slant right against it and then you're gonna get your one by one flat smooth it's gray put it right there and then you're gonna get one of your detailed slant pieces here and put it right up right there and then what you're gonna do is get your um, uh, other weirdly slanted piece here put it up against the side right there and then you're gonna get this uh, slant or arched piece here and put it right next to that and then you're gonna get this one by one flat smooth put it right here and then you're gonna get this detailed slant piece and you're gonna put it right there like that and then you're gonna get this one by one flat smooth and put it right at the end and as you can see the rock is looking very jagged so far which is a good thing because sea rocks are extremely jagged and then you're gonna get your um, uh, detail, other detailed slant piece put right here along the back and then you're gonna get your one by one flat smooth and you're gonna put it right here for a tree root coming off of the tree which will be there in just a minute <clears throat> then you're gonna get this one by two flat smooth Put it right there and that is how you build the rock and now what all you have to do is get your palm tree if you have a palm tree if not I guess you could use a bush or something and raise it to the ground or do whatever you want but the palm tree works the best put it right there right in the only space left in the back and you can see the tree root coming off of it and that is how you build your Lego tropical island scene I guess you could say or beach scene there you go and I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Please do not forget to subscribe in the bottom left-hand corner of the screen where it says Wacko Lab. Thank you guys so much for watching.